gonna tell Kirk Franklin, I say, I wanna take him to King of Diamond with me. He can go in that mall, he ain't gotta get no dancing now. He can go in there and turn right around and go take him a little holy bath and he gonna be back holy. Kirk, listen, you go to King of Diamond with me and I come to church with you. I even swap ain't no When he was talking, I couldn't understand what he was saying. I had to play it four or five times. Like, what is it? But you know what the man, much respect to him, you know, it was really cool for him to reach out and, you know, uh, you know, what I think for me more than anything is that, uh, the reason why I responded is because I want to show people that, that as a Christian, we're, we're not untouchable. That, you know, I'm, you know, that I feel like it would be very, you know, kind of disrespectful for another human being to say something to you because, oh, he's not a church person. I can't say nothing back. I mean, you know what, you know, who am I? You know, that, that, that's the type of mantra I try to live up under, you know, is, you know, who am I? So. so are you going to the strip club? No, girl, you heard what I said. I said I'm going to walk on the curb. I walk on the curb if you go to a three-hour, three-hour church service. It's got to be three hours. It's got to be a good, it's got to be one of churches where the AC don't work. So three hours of just sweat and stank. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And then yeah. afterwards, we'll get the food. I may, yeah, and, and then we'll get the food, we'll get the church uh, cookout food, you know, you know, the fresh fish, and then, uh, you know, the, the fried fish and the french fries, and then maybe I may walk on the curb of the club. Yeah, just walk by the curb. <laughs>